Hello all, welcome to the series of tutorials on TestLink. So today uh, we all will be uh, learning about uh, the user management in TestLink. So how to create a user, what all rights you can provide to that user. So let's have a look. So let's log in into the application. And this is the home page. So for user management, you have to go here and see. This is user management, a small boy image is there. So just uh, click on that link. Okay, so this is uh, the user management page. Uh, there are four tabs out here. View users, what all users are currently set up as of now. Then second one belongs to view roles. Okay, so you can see out here that uh, there are different roles defined. Uh, test designer, guest, senior tester, tester, administrator, and a leader. Third tab involves uh, assigning the test project roles. So the first tab shows test project. So which project uh, you want to assign a person to and uh, set roles to, so, like which person you want to assign to that particular project. Either it is a test designer or a senior tester, tester admin. Uh, like this. So see here, tester one, senior tester, test link. So I am the administrator. Coming to fourth tab, assign test plan roles. Uh, like similarly, uh, the previous one, uh, like assign test projects. So we have assigned uh, test plan roles as well. So who all can access the test plan or who all can edit or, uh, uh, you know, modify the test plans, etc. Okay, uh, so uh, just to uh, brief about uh, the role permissions. So a user can see the current role in top line of the test link window. So if you see here, this is the user, current user that I'm logged in as. So I am an admin and the username is test link. And each user has a generic role that applies on all the projects and administrator can assign specific project roles for a particular project. Users can modify the role for particular test plan as well. Okay, so uh, let's go here and uh, let's try to create a user. So click on this create button. Uh, what login name you want, suppose um, tester2. First name can be, uh, suppose, Pishek, last name Singh, password as per your choice. So, uh, then you can give any email, suppose, uh, Dot com. Now, which role you want to assign this user as? Uh, as a guest or a test designer or a senior tester, tester, administrator or a leader. So, for example, we take here as a tester. Okay, so local means uh, which uh, language you want to take. So, Indonesian, Italian. So, I'll prefer as English. And this is like uh, active and the expiration date so when this user uh, will be going to expire time span so you can take as per uh, the requirement suppose i take uh, 30th september click on save okay so see our user is added tester 2 go here so if you want you can edit or you can see the details out here Okay, so yeah, so this is the use uh, like how you can create a user into uh, this test link. And uh, as I said, uh, roles, so these are all the roles defined. Uh, if you want to see what all uh, access a particular role has, you can just go to that particular uh, role, suppose tester, see. 
so these are the rights that a particular user has and all the rights are shown out here whichever is the tick mark you can edit as well as per the requirement so if I talk about the default roles for this tester so it has a test plan execution role test plan matrix creation uh, test cases uh, view read only access uh, keyword view read only access and I think that's it so possibly uh, say for example you want to edit the roles and you want to provide an access of test case creation and editing so just click on that click save here click on OK so the role is modified so like this uh, as per the project requirements uh, you can modify uh, the rights assigned to a particular role and coming to the next one is assigned test project roles so you have to select the project out here whichever project you want to take suppose test project 2 and uh, you want to set roles so which role you want to set suppose I am setting tester so all these users have been set to a role as tester for this particular test project click on update and that is updated so tester 1 and tester 2 are set as uh, tester test project role and this is me I am the administrator as usual okay so uh, coming to next part is assigning test plan roles so I hope uh, test plan you all know like I have explained in my previous uh, videos so you, here you can see here this is the test project name so test project 1 and uh, test plan here you can select the test plan as of now we have only one test plan created in the system and the role setting suppose test designer okay so these are the users that are uh, available and uh, you want to set roles so you can change the role out here and just click on do so see both these tester 1 and tester 2 they are set to a test designer roles click on update and that's done so so I hope this is all clear and uh, so this is all about user management uh, and viewing their roles what all users are available in the system and you can edit the rights and you can create new users and that's it so I hope uh, you all got some idea on the user management part and if you like the video uh, please uh, subscribe my channel and uh, we'll meet in the next uh, tutorial thank you very much for watching my video bye bye